Alright Andy, I wanted to show you this. I finally got the display going here. I wanted to do a visual. Basically the, the screen shows the user which way he needs to position the device. You know, which way he's out of whack. And if you, if you watch the actual real bullseye, spirit level up in the upper right, we're pretty damn close. Andy, it kind of reminds me of that that DS game, Kirby Tilt and Tumble. Remember that? Anyway, I find worked out the scaling. There's a small lag from when you move it because I'm running the pitch and roll values from the accelerometer through a rolling boxcar average. So I've tried eight terms, sixteen terms, thirty-two terms. 16 terms seems to be pretty good. It doesn't bounce, you know, it doesn't flicker. So that's going to be it right there. I'm going to make a few more improvements. Now granted, the display on this thing is so small, so it's actually scaled. It's only 10 degrees, minus 10 degrees to plus 10 degrees is all I'm really interested in. If you want if you you can visually see 10 degrees I'm more interested in getting it perfectly level as you can see the pitch and roll are both zero and the bottom is the coordinates X and Y the top left of the display is the origin but other than that I got it so now I've got to port this code over into the other device which is be basically a cut and paste the display on the other device is uh, 98 by 64 pixels. This display is 128 by 64, so basically I just kept it to the left of the screen. There it is. The uh, a built a digital bullseye level built around analog devices, ADXL 345 accelerometer. It's a fun little project.